these bags came out and like everybody had them. Little did I know they probably got it from Amazon. <laughs> so did I. So this bag. beautiful and welcome back to my channel my name is Yashima and if you're new here I create style beauty and lifestyle videos today's video is a little bit different from the ones that I've done in the past and going forward I think this is where I'll stay but you let me know how you feel about it in the comments below so today I'll be sharing with you how I get the looks look for less and I'll be doing that by sharing with you my designer dupe collection so if you're okay so before i start with the actual items that i own i want to share with you the difference between dupes and replicas today i'll be showing you mostly dupes so the difference between dupes and a replica a replica is basically a photocopy of the designer item it looks exactly alike i know that because i've owned a replica bag before um, and then a dupe a dupe just has like similarities doesn't have the logo or anything about the bag but it looks very similar to the designer item okay so, so now that we have that understanding let's get into the item this bag came out i was like i had to have it and so i did they were on amazon <laughs> so why not so this is the bag it's the cult gaia bamboo arc bag as i got it for like 60 bucks on amazon i've only worn it a few times um, because i realized that i didn't like it this big I actually thought it was going to be much smaller when i bought it but i really like it it really does give you that vacation vibe if you're interested i do have it on my poshmark for sale so i will leave the link in the description mark below so you can purchase all right so my next dupe which i actually just got like a week or so ago is a dupe of the balenciaga's everyday sunglasses and these are they they are so chic i have been wearing them basically every day since i got them and this is how they look on and this is definitely how you can like elevate your look with a really cool pair of sunglasses the only difference with this, because it's a dupe, it doesn't have like the Balenciaga um, logo on the side in white, but these are so cool. I absolutely love them. And I got them, I think, for like $13. I will link it below if you are interested. So cute. Okay, so the next two pairs of shoes that I'm going to share with you are dupes of Gucci. And one pair I've shown in like a couple videos already which are these the sam edelman lorraine loafer this is the first pair and the next pair i just recently got literally when i got those sunglasses i got these and there's listen guys two years ago i got a pair from sam edelman and that pair was it wasn't very easy to walk in even though i love the style i love like it was white I love that it gave me that look that I was looking for, but it was un very uncomfortable to walk in. I've had to like try to keep my feet in. I don't know if you know, like when you wear a certain type of muse like they, you would have to like keep your feet in when you walk in, walk in them. So that was my struggle and I didn't like that. So I ended up selling them on my Poshmark. So I wanted to replace them and I was thinking about actually spending $600 and getting the uh, mules. But then I was searching Amazon and I saw these and they were like 50 bucks. And I was like, let me have them because they're actual leather. And as you can see, it doesn't have the Gucci logo or anything, even though it does look very similar to the Gucci Prince Down mules. I got mine in a size 40, size 9. Um, and they're really comfortable to walk in. They're not as heavy as the Sam Edelman ones that I had in the past. I can keep my feet in the shoe without having to struggle to, you know, keep the shoe on while I walk. So I'm super happy that I have these in my collection now. I'm not sure if I'll get the actual Gucci ones. I'm still debating it, but we'll see. We'll see how the future unfolds with these. But these are a really good dupe. So, so 
yeah the link will be below okay so i have a couple of chanel dupes so i'm gonna get into that so the first one i got last christmas so i saw it i wasn't even looking for this actually i was looking for a, another like dupe of a designer bag but then i got so yeah i was looking for a different bag and this showed up in the suggested pile this was going to be on my designer wish list this is a dupe because it has that look but it doesn't have the chanel emblem that usually that's usually like right here in the middle of the bag but it does has like the same shape just about the same size i haven't seen the original in person but it does look very similar from the pictures that i've seen yeah. I just love it it has a, the similarities with the gold and silver hardware and guys this was so cheap like it was I think $30 it wasn't expensive at all and I just I had to wrap it up so quick I'm like let me get into that so it's really really cute it definitely elevates a look it gives that chic rich vibes which I like and I don't have to spend my coins to get the look so all right so the next dupe that i have from chanel is the 2018 chevron puffy flat bag and i have it in the color pink it's so pretty it's so gorgeous and for 50 dollars like you can't beat that with a stick nowhere okay it looks exactly like the chanel chevron the design the hardware i mean it doesn't have the chanel you know the cc's there but it has just about every similar look to the bag of course it's not made as sturdy as the actual chanel but it does give you the look that you want and that's luxury so i love this shade of pink it does so much for a look like this would look so pretty with an all white look like white leg pants a fitted top so pretty so pretty um, I do have a luxury wish list that I'm going to share with you guys in the next couple of days so if you like this video make sure you thumbs it up and subscribe so you don't miss any of my future uploads they're gonna be so good and you are going to love them so yeah all right so the next designer dupe you've seen it already i shared it in my last video if you watched if not you can go back and watch it but you can do that after but anyways the shoe is the chanel dad sandals and these are the dupes i got them from asos like i said in the last video but i don't want to stay too long but because you guys already know what it is these are the shoes and they're super cute and they're really crusty guys i wore them i wear these a lot so excuse the crust in the shoe all right guys so the next designer dupes that i'm going to share with you are from bottega veneta i fell in love with the design of the next two bags i'm going to show you they're similar just different colors so the first one is a this and this is the dupe to the cassette bag and this size is the nine and a half i don't even think they have a color like this so that's how you know um <laughs> it's it's a very pale yellow they have like a more true yellow and then a more beigeish yellow but this one is i really like it i really love it this is <laughs> like Bottega Veneta doesn't have a written logo on any of their bags at least the ones that I've seen but this does does definitely look like a replica it does not look like a dupe I'm just gonna say that um because everything is just so similar to the actual bag that is on their site with the with this triangle um hardware and <sighs> The inside this one I haven't really used as yet so it's still stuffed but I really like the color I love the size it's so pretty it's a pretty yellow looks really nice against neutrals black this is so perfect for summer I love it I love this I love this one I couldn't decide when I ordered if I wanted the yellow alone or the white so i bought both so the next one that i'm going to share with you is 
the white one and I, I'm actually wearing the white one more than the yellow well I haven't worn the yellow yet but I've been wearing this just about every day to work and I really like it it fits just about all my essentials that I need for the day and I have it nicely wrapped like this because I thought it was very cute um, like if you're gonna wear it as a clutch or you know just under your arm I think this would look so cute just like this without having the strap hanging but you can wear it crossbody as well um, the only thing I don't like about it is that it doesn't have the option to add like a top handle but for the price it works I love both this one is a little bigger bigger than the yellow one this one is a 10 inch um, in length I love neutral tone bags but I just love the bevel design of the bag this is so cute it really gives you a look a different vibe when you have cute accessories to pair with it and I've been trying to do more of that with my accessories because my style in clothes are very simple very basic but I want to elevate it by adding like those special pieces and if it means getting a designer dupe then that's what she's going to do just bear with me I'm almost done I just have two more luxury dupes to show you and the first to the last is this Bottega Veneta these bags came out and like everybody had them little did I know they probably got it from Amazon <laughs> so so did I. I don't have any color like this, which is why I purchased it. I think for this to look more luxe, you have to keep it stuffed so it looks more filled and just luxurious. Otherwise, it just looks like that. And that, that's not cute to me. I have not been reaching for this. I got this in December and I'm not sure if I'm, I'm going to keep it. So I may put it up on my Poshmark account. So if you're interested in it, let me know in the comments and... Um, I can get it out to you and it comes with actually a crossbody strap that you can shorten or lengthen so I really like this feature I love being able to be hands-free and so whenever I can do that it's a win so I think that's the reason why I bought it too the fact that I don't have a color like this in my collection and that it comes with a crossbody so I don't necessarily have to hold it in my hand or under my arm like that but I like it I like it I like it enough to keep but if you're interested I will let it go all right and the very last designer bag guys is has been sitting behind me all this time and I absolutely love her I finally got my hands on it I think last Christmas as well I think I got myself three designer dupes for Christmas <laughs> this was one of them the original designer of this bag I thought it was just a bag that you got on Amazon but the actual design or brand is called shrimp but this beautiful creation the fact that it's like beaded it is sturdy like this is not gonna come apart anytime soon it looks exactly like the original like and I keep like crazy stuff in it. I think I'm going to do like um, what's in my bag video. If you guys are interested, let me know. Um, I've been wanting to do one of those forever. So if you want to, then I will. But this bag is so gorgeous. I love it. It does bring a really chic vibe to your look. Very luxurious. And it's just perfect for any look that you want to like take it up a notch okay guys so that is the end of the video thank you so much for watching I really had a good time sharing these items with you I think it's a really good idea to if you're in into like luxury pieces but you don't want to spend you know the luxury price it's okay to get the dupe don't let anyone pressure you or make you feel less than because you know you, it's just not in your budget so it's okay and I'm fine with it you see all that I have and I will continue to add as I go um, but I will be sharing my my actual luxury uh, pieces with you guys in the next video it's a very small collection so be on the lookout for that 
and um don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss my upcoming uploads i will see you guys in the next video thank you again so much for watching and bye